Hello everyone, my name is Spitfire back with another reaction. This time I'm pleased to do this series. It's the Color Goddess episode 3. I think this one's called The Training uh, by me script. Again, uh, there's your link in the description. Go check out our channel. Make some really good content. Go watch it. It's fun. Go check it out. Shoot. Go over there and watch it. Don't stay here. Watch it. Uh, but yeah, this is training. So it's gonna be a training. Uh, gonna be a training episode. I can't wait for the montage. That always seems to happen. I don't know. It usually happens in audio dramas. I've watched for the. I guess you'd watch it. I don't know. Uh, I still haven't watched one since. I think the last one I checked out was Remembrance, and that was like eight years ago. And I think it's still being made. I can't believe that it's like still being made. I just remember that being like a series that everyone talked to, I talked about for a while, and then they were, and it dropped, and now it's back. I mean, it's weird, but that's the, like the last one I remember, and I just don't remember anything from that uh, thing. So maybe a thing I need to go back to, but I might have to start from the game. I don't remember anything about the Remembrance, but that may be a fun thing to revisit. It, uh, sooner or later down the, down the line because I'm excited. I'm back and I'm enjoying myself doing this kind of stuff doing like actually actual like I don't know what you would call this uh, like a fan work or to say kind of fan fiction thing I don't know what you would call it I'm always kind of concerned when I say that to different people because they might get offended or things I don't know what to call these things but I'm trying to talk to someone big this is a fan work is just like something that you know, it's made by a fan, so I guess it would technically be a fan work. It's very dumb. What's this? I don't know what I'm saying. Um, we're expecting a montage uh, and some training. Uh, so, yeah, I can't wait for this. And again, without further ado, once, jump into it. Previously, on Here the color goddess, on I have color overheard goddess. a threat heading towards Equestria. Oh, this one. King Sephidos. I don't know what I was talking about. I was on... Take over again. My legs have vanished! Rainbow! What's happening to me? Blue Why is it so loud? You're alive? <laughs> Why is the fuck is it so loud still? You <laughs> see, I just supply power to your locket. Your special loud, my guy. goddess powers. I was just about to ask how you got back here and how long you had to travel and how far you were. Who are you? What are you doing here? Please, don't hurt me. I didn't mean to eavesdrop. Only one of us can escape, and I'm thinking it should be me. Are you crazy? If you're rendered just a soul, you won't have complete control of yourself. Where would Equestrium be without the peace and harmony you provide? She must have the power of the runaway goddess from thousands of years ago. But I have consumed the power from two goddesses. I just have to get rid of her. Then Equestria will be mine! Cool. What if one actually has our intro? What did the other ones not have this intro? Okay. Just add after like the, the two ones. It's so loud. It's, it's super loud for some reason. Why is it so loud still? Fuck it, I'm not gonna bother with it. Let's see what this episode's about. I can't wait for my computer to crash again, too. That might happen again. Hopefully not. I knocked on wood like five times. Hopefully not. Rainbow, if you can hear me, I am able to communicate to you. Though it is beyond my power to leave the confines of your shell, I still have the power to help you in this journey of yours. One important thing you must know so. is that... You are not alone. Oh, that, never mind. You I think the fate of Equestria rests it's only on your rainbow, shoulders. So you can't leave Rainbow. But, but you have again, your friends to guide you as well. Could happen, like, Just be oh, okay. of the many dangerous obstacles that you will face. And what is very important is to look for the... Rainbow! Rainbow! Wake up, Rainbow! Uh, oh, five more minutes. Dream. 
No! <laughs> well, you have to be rude okay, about it. Okay, I Calm get down. it. Uh, I'm not a morning pony, you know. Neither no am I, my guy. Every single minute we spend sleeping is another point where King Sephiros will invade this land and destroy it. Nist, you need to chill. You're panicking way too much about this. Won't it take him a week to get here too? I don't think it will. <laughs> Wake up now or Fern take off the edge of the house! Effect. Too late, she's Oh, awake. I'm gonna default dance over this. And what did well, you say about fucking effect, my guy. Oh, never mind. The air horn don't mind me. For a cute little being such as yourself, you seem to have some Random, very uh, cool of air horn? Okay. Anyway, going off cool. topic. Today is the day where I will train you to use your powers, and hopefully you'll be better at defeating the enemy that way. Rainbow will be training today? Better grab popcorn! Sometimes I can't tell who is more random, my grandmother or Pinkie Pie. Who knows? Wait, did Twilight put a cloud walking spell on you? Oh yes, Twilight. We can't keep her waiting. Why are we going to Twilight's? To do some research. Oh, great. Research? Ugh, really? I still need to eat! I'm sure there'll still be plenty of pancakes left over. <laughs> ah! You cool. two are just on Good schedule! Is. This is Robert so exciting! Why are we doing this? Misty thought it would be a good idea Robert to read about fun. who you would be fighting Hopefully against. Learn different, different this creators is not something to scoff about. This is serious! Even more serious than getting an A minus on a test. <laughs> yeah, okay. Seriously, Nist, why are we hitting the books first? I am making yeah, a good book. point here. No one should be too confident before going into a battle. Never, I'm not gonna hit my book. Research is important. The only so one next you know to what me to do is, when the time uh, comes. But how so many books are we talking about this King Savito guy? Book. Didn't Princess Lestia say that only her private up. historians wrote about him? Luckily, I have one of the editions right here. It is a little dusty, but I'm sure it's still readable. When I became Celestia's protege, she gave me all of the private history books. Yeah. Only she and I have read them. Though I didn't hear about King Sephiros or Tenebri before, however. I guess I just brushed it aside for years. Even when I was reorganizing, I forgot well, about these books. <laughs> because she does that in this. Ah, here it is. King Sephiros. Attacked Equestria roughly 10,000 years ago. He was a forceful ruler and a very powerful king. He declared war eyes. on Equestria for more land, and many brave soldiers sacrificed their lives to stop him. He was successfully banished by Princess Celestia when she performed a sonic rainbow. <sighs> and it sent me away too. Look, here's a diagram of the estimated height estimated. and size of him. That doesn't look too bad. He's fearless against ants, too! <laughs> There's all nothing right. to worry about at all. We'll be fine. Um, Rainbow, that dot you call an ant is actually the size of a pony. What? Two. Let me see that. You're uh, not kidding. This guy is huge! 1,000 feet? He's estimated to be more than 100 feet. feet tall. Most canums are close or even midway to that height. Except one. You met a canum? She was a good Kanem. Her name was Lyako. She was King Sephiros' daughter. You gotta put the, she showed uh, the foot. A hundred feet tall? How am I supposed to beat that? Although, I also heard that the goddesses themselves are almost the same height as him. If you truly did have the power I told you were of giant him, people, maybe you ponies. would be evenly matched to him. Well, according to the correct mathematics, of course. They're in a prison. Oh, in Unless that case... That means I can easily disguise. kick his flank. I don't know why this was so That's hard in the first place. Who's ready for me tall? to save Equestria? That's I know why I am. Yeah. Who are you talking to? The audience, of course. Can't you uh, see them? Stop uh, poking uh, me, please. Mind. I don't like being touched. Right. Please stop well, it. Even when you might be evenly matched in height, you might not be in skill. That's why you shouldn't be too confident, Rainbow. I know. I know. <laughs> So, Sweeney, did you bring the thing? I did. It is quite heavy. Where could it have come from? Who found it again? I did. When we were trying to find something to do with the ball. Okay. Are you sure? 
sure it's a good idea to go outside alone? To quote my sister, y'all are old enough to wander by yourselves responsibly. I think we'll be just fine. Call Sweetie Belle over, would ya? Uh, sure. Sweetie Belle! Where did she go? Oh. Wee! Sweetie, Sweetie Belle! Belle. <laughs> huh? Oh, sorry. Coming. Okay, I have Sweet. Ugh, you have got to be kidding me. Typical. I'll go right, Spike will go left. And Sweetie can go straight. Uh, what's the what? plan? Why? Easiest way to find some ponies to split up, right? I guess. Never she split probably the party. hasn't gone too far. Maybe this wasn't such a good idea. Where did I come from again? What's this? Aw, this is so pretty. I wonder if a mare dropped I... this. It is a rather peculiar brooch, it. isn't it? Hmm. Apple Blue! Probably something oh, very hey, sweetie. magical. Check this out. Ooh, it looks really like pretty. An artifact. Was this on the ground? Yep, it probably belongs to someone inside. We should return it. Apple Bloom! Sweetie Bells! It's a oh, artifact we better get going! Times. Yeah. By the time we found the brooch, almost every pony had gone home. <sighs> it's a shame we can find who it belonged to. Then we should keep it. It looks so pretty. If we could eat it. And the center and looks so power. delicious. You're not eating this brooch, Spike. Give him the power. Well, it probably belongs to some pony. Skill is right. We can't just keep it for ourselves. We need to be responsible and hand it over to a lost and found. Some pony could be worried sick trying to look for it. Uh, you're right. But if we can't find the pony it belongs to, then can we keep it? I don't know, sweetie. It just doesn't That's feel right. Goes. Please. Oh. Seriously, sweetie, okay. I... Please. You too, Spike. Please. Please. <sighs> I feel like it'd be like a... Fine. Uh, Yay. Uh, You're engraved. still not Worth eating like a it. Secret Aww. Code. Well, we got we got some chanting. Now, what you have to do is focus your energy into your locket. Um, how do I do that? I'm not a unicorn. <sighs> Just think about transforming and you'll do it. Okay, here it goes. <sighs> Woohoo! We have power! Want some? More PNGs. Uh, Fun. sure? Maybe she was just practicing in one of Twilight's spells gone wrong? Ooh, maybe she's transforming into a goddess like Twilight uh, yeah, said. Into a what? Come on! Oh my goodness! That seems to be happening. What in tarnation? Oh my Celestia! Strange! That cloud looks like Dashi! Wait a minute! That is Dashi! Going on? Why is Rainbow gigantic? Oh, hello, Rainbow's friends. Come to watch the show. There's plenty of popcorn. <gasps> Blue streak. <laughs> Say what now? You're alive? But well, we thought you sacrificed yourself. I did, but now I'm back as a genie. No pony question. This. Agreed. Rainbow, are you okay up there? Whoa! Yeah. When did I get so high up? You guys look like ants! So, why is Rainbow Dash the size of T-Rex when he tried to take over Equestria? This is how big the goddesses are in reality, and King Sephiros is a similar height to this. <sighs> now, Rainbow, try to uh, lift something. Lift something? Oh, how? Uh, use your locket. Use your Since it's already powered up, you won't need Blue Streak. Try picking up that tree. Okay then! Whoa! That's impressive! What's happening now? Oh no, she's using too much power. Rainbow, you need to transform back now! Oh, I feel faint. Rainbow! 
Oh my god, what are we gonna do? Rainbow, are you okay? Yo, Rainbow. Rainbow? She used too much power. You alright? Her body isn't used to using this much energy. Of course it would tire her out. No kidding. She's out cold. Hold on! I know CPR! She is breathing, Sugar Cube. Oh! Never Where's mind. I'll carry her back to her house. She'll be fine. She just needs time to rest. <sighs> I Seems like it. She just needs to uh, hone it. Well, that was interesting. Hone that power. Yeah, better get back to harvesting apples. It was nice seeing you again, Blue Streak. Wait for me, Twilight! That power. Well, that's why it's called training. Are you okay? Uh, I'm just worried for oh Rainbow. No. Is it because of what lies ahead? About King Sephiros? It's just, I don't know when he'll arrive. He could arrive any second for all I know. I just want Rainbow to be ready. I know she is the one to defeat him, but right now, I have a hard time believing that. You shouldn't say that. She was only just starting to use her powers in that way after all. As Twilight says, we okay. can't judge a book by its blurb. Give Rainbow some time. You'll see. She will get better. I know she will. Of course you would know. You've known each other since you were Phillies, right? That's right. And we've been through a lot of tough situations. All six of us have. But we have managed to pull through everything that was thrown at us. I just don't want her to be unprepared. I don't want her to get hurt. I don't want her to- She won't. I know. <sighs> I don't know what's wrong with me. This is a song. What I wish for was to drain until the rain would go away. happened before was the same through all the shame it was today I know I must start believing I need to stop expecting now. songs but because when this she's is like this I promise there are songs every my mind. episode maybe even two every episode I wanted is this it. what I wanted? I wished her to be stronger Now I'd carry on longer It's not what I wanted What I wished for Was to fly up to the sky as I would say Not bad. Song. But what happened before I was denied that will to glide it was today Why is enjoy the backtracks that she chooses? I know I am oh, very a nice. big I mean, like, deal Uh think she gets from I other fans the fate or of people that she has kind of not in my hood generic free alone. Is this what I wanted? Is this what I wanted? I wished I was awesome, but not just to cross him. It's not what I wanted. I know you will get better. I know you'll comprehend that the Equestria must be protected till the very end with a friend. Is this what I wanted? Is this what I wanted? I was awesome, but when she's like this, it's not what I wanted. Is this what I 
this what I wanted? Is this what I wanted? Literally, yeah, f a thumbs up for this song. Good song. Good, Becky Jack. Everything good. You're still after that artifact? What are we gonna do? We still have the brooch! So we keep it? No, sweetie. We haven't even started our search yet. This brooch looks really expensive, too. That pony must be heartbroken to have lost it. It probably cost a couple thousand bits. A couple thousand? Come on, Apple Bloom. It's it surely isn't that much. You're right. It's worth a million bits. The brooch is worth a million bits? It's an artifact. <laughs> what brooch? What? There's no brooch. No brooch here. Nope. And it's biking, Definitely it's a... not one that's he'll worth get, he'll, a he'll million the power bits. Of the artifact. Yep. We said nothing. You know I heard your entire conversation, right? What? Sis, you eavesdropped? You were right behind me. But you shouldn't eavesdrop. Apple Bloom, may I see it? There is a... <sighs> Fine. I keep, we were going to yeah, find who it belonged to, we promise! That's right! Say. We found it outside in the garden. Somebody must have dropped it. Yeah, it probably cost a million. We know! This is an odd looking brooch. I'm not even sure where it should have attached itself. <laughs> Distracted what does by that the bunnies. Mean? Well. Look over there! Aww! Oh, it's so cute! I wonder if that's Angel's girlfriend. Are you kidding? Angel doesn't have a girlfriend. What else could it be? Probably just a bunny friend. Nope. Like us. Nope. Uh, We're that's, best um, friends. Maybe she's his best friend. Uh, that's um... <laughs> they're... They're kissing. They're not kissing, Sweetie Belle. Oh, oh, that's just gross. It's beautiful. <laughs> Wait, Angel, Angel finally. And the Angel. Bunny sitting in a tree. My man, Angel. You've got to be kidding me. Good job, my guy. Are you feeling better? Yes, I you guess so. You have too much. You just uh, need more faith in me, Woodash. I know she can do it. Me too. Hey, isn't that oh, Applejack with the CMC? What are they that doing at your cottage? Chibi art. Huh? You're right. Oh, hi, Sugar Cube. What's going on? We just saw Angel nestling this cute little brown bunny. It looked like they were kissing. Oh, how romantic. No, it's not. Seriously, they're just friends. Bunny friends. No. Why? Why now? Flourisha, you okay? Angel has... not that bad. It... Angel has... <laughs> Flourisha, where are you going? Angel has a girlfriend? I never wanted this. You can have an I angel, angel friend, to be with me another forever. bunny, and then later you can have multiple him to angel leave me bunnies. Flourish! Angel, angel, angel five like that. and angel six. Flourish. Hey Applejack, where did you get that brooch? Huh? Oh, uh, my sister found it. Is it yours? It is a similar color to that vest thing you're wearing. No, it doesn't belong to me. I've never seen anything like it before. That is odd. Do you also know what's going into Flourish? No, I don't, I'm afraid. I wish I could help her like she helped me. What am I going to do? About Rainbow, right? Uh-huh. Sure. Rainbow become a natural at it. Don't worry about it. Transforming? Uh, yeah, that. She just needs a bit of practice. It shouldn't be too bad from there. That's how every pony gets good at something. When I was younger, my parents passed away a few days after a Timberwolf attack. Even though I received my cutie mark, I thought it was something that could damage me forever. It could send me to the pits of despair. But do you want to know why I didn't go that way? How? Even when I was feeling down about their death, I was still able to hold my head up high. What I was that, able though? to continue my passion as I always uh, wanted to do. Is it a bucket? Looking after my family as my parents once looked Look after at me. I kept doing what I loved and I got <clears> better at it from there. I never would have known that I would have learned something from something so painful I wanted to forget. When Rainbow was feeling down about Tank, I knew what she was going through. Of course, back then, I didn't want to tell any pony else about the tragedy. I didn't want them to worry about me, because I was the helper. But nowadays, I do get help for various things that I can't handle by myself. And it's all things to understand in friends like them. What has that got to do with me? Don't let Rainbow's lack of practice bring you down. 
She's still learning, as is every pony. Not even the smartest pony in Equestria would have been finished learning. <sighs> Rainbow oh, does still have a lot to learn, I know that. But I can tell you one thing. True. She will be ready, and she will protect us no matter what. Thanks, Applejack. Huh? Oh. Chiora Rani? I huh? told you. You can read that? Somehow it's I It's an can. artifact. Maybe I have seen this brooch before. It can't belong to anyone else. Say what now? Who does it belong to? Yurika. The writing is in an ancient goddess language. It translates to color and rain. Incredible. Looks like I'm looking after this brooch for the time being. Thank you for finding it. No problem, Sugar Cube. Hey, what happened to the brooch? It turns out Misty was the owner without even realizing it. Aww. Oh, well. At least it's good that the brooch is back with its owner. I wonder how Spike is going Maybe to react. We'll say... That would be funny! Oh. This isn't fair! Why did she leave us? Yes, she's gone. But she did it to save us. I wish we could just escape too. I know, but we can't. If we left, we'd be souls like Haruka. And we still have enough power to help the ponies of Equestria with their land. You understand that, right? But Satoru, we've been trapped here for thousands of years! Growing weaker and weaker. I feel my magic might be at my limit trying to help them. Wouldn't it be better for both of us to leave much, this but place? A bit of pop How much bit longer of pop will this go on for? That's fine. We don't Thanks have time to worry about her. Like some we must people. stay here. As long as we don't succumb to King Sephiroth, Equestria will be safe. She truly cares for us, doesn't she? Then why can't we escape? It should be as simple as that! There are ponies back there who can carry on our duties even now, and most of them don't even know we exist. Why can't we make that known to them? Why can't we help them? What has Herka done to us? Don't talk about our sister like that. What she did was not in vain. She did it to save Equestria. Imagine what would have happened if she stayed. There would be nothing left. Do you understand that, Lumina? You wouldn't understand, would you, Lumina? I don't think so. Satra, are you alright? Oh, no. You're angrier than normal. Let me help. Stay away. Just stay away. Satra, what's happening to us? We were fighting just like that. I don't want to see you hurt like that, ever! I I'm sorry about what I said. It was wrong of me. Can you forgive me? Satra! What's going on? Are you okay? I'm Howard. I must be at my limit. No! Then... Ponies of Equestria will- I will be fine. I just need to extract my being, like Haruka did. What does that mean? I look after three components. Okay. Animals, trees, and ponies. I will bestow these components to three others. I will still be alive. This can't happen. First Haruka has to go away, and now you? I don't want to be alone. You will not be alone. You will stay loyal to Equestria as I can right. help. So it's another one who is going to find its way into it. Ah! Oh, where's that one going? Oh no. This is bad. Don't you worry, Rima. I'm still alive in these orbs. I'm not completely lifeless as I appear. Hopefully, the ones who wield these powers are still able to help us break free. I'm counting on them. Okay. That was an episode. So what the, uh, what the, uh, Chris rule? And then I'll say everything 
at the end. I guess I can break down a little bit of pointers. Not really pointers, but some stuff that I uh, really enjoyed at the start. Like I said, really fun song. Uh, told you it's an artifact. But they won't believe me. It's an artifact. Of the gods. This be very powerful and a very, like, powerful artifact. Or it already has the power in it from when she... I don't want to say died. But, you know, it's powerless. I don't know what to say. She's probably dead. I don't know. It already has the power in it from when she. I don't want to say died. But you know. Yeah, like I said, uh, the power could already have left the kind of the brooch where the artifact, as I called it. But. Yeah, so it was inscribed, so that's a, that's a good sign to be like, yeah, that's an that's a artifact of the gods. It's inscribed with their own language. I think it probably is, like, powerful. Now, if she could turn into a giant woman pony creature, well, I don't know what they, I don't know what they, uh, how, I don't know how this, the thing works. I didn't remember. I don't think they even, I don't know if they said it or not. If, like, I don't know, I don't know if this will happen. Like, uh, I'm just going to throw it out there because I don't think it would actually happen. But if, let's say, Rainbow Dash got dead, he just died, would the goddess's power find a new post that is also worthy of the power? Maybe? I don't know, like, like I said, I've, it's been a couple, you know, it's been a while since I've actually seen the first uh, actual. Uh, audio drama, so I don't know if they actually tend to mention that or glossed over it. I, I, I forgot because I'm an idiot and my brain is, uh, I've got small brain instead of a big brain. Uh, my brain very small. Uh, but yeah, I didn't know if they mentioned it in the actual fanfiction, what would happen if one of the, uh, once the goddesses give their power, if they're also immortal, where they can still die in their mortal, their soul, the goddess's soul will just find a new host. Or if the god's power, the goddess's powers are just kind of lost forever into the, in, for, into the ether. I don't know, like I said, if they mention that, I might, I, they might, they might have, I'm just being an idiot. But again, again, she's been commenting, so she'll, 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 uh, she'll let me know, she'll notify me if that's what happens. Because I'm still dumb and stupid and need some guidance. But yeah, this was very fun. I really enjoyed this episode. Uh, really fun. Had a lot of had a lot of fun. And, uh, just making jokes and having fun. So I yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. I know I sure did. Uh, remember to stay home, stay safe, peace out, and bye. Better get ready for the assault. Balls to the wall and it's all your fault. You just had to ransack the royal fault, so it's payback. All y'all are in default. First, everybody roll for decks. Next, reflect on your last respects. None of you pass the check. All of you feel the effect of the hex. Flex, that's the answer. Or do you forget that I'm a necromancer? Shatter in the neck of the blade dancer. Making a wreck out of the dragon lancer. Last chance to pray to the god of your choosing. And if you're fortunate, maybe you can get some mercy.